Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to a weekly vlog. So today is Friday and I'm actually heading into London and I'm going to the Champion of Women Awards with Style Cheap, which is very exciting. Um, I'm going as my friend Isabella's plus one. She always gets me the best invites. so. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm gonna meet Sophie there, which will be really nice and just have a nice fun day. I'm wearing a lovely dress from Style Cheat, which I will show you in a second. I've never been to like an award ceremony or anything, but it should be really fun. There's like a champagne reception, three course meal. So it's a very fun activity for a Friday. I've got a couple of events and fun things coming up over the next few weeks. So that is what this vlog is gonna be. Unfortunately, they're not all close enough together for me to just kind of film day after day. So this vlog is gonna be spread out over about three weeks. So hopefully that's okay. So this is my dress. Really, really gorgeous dress, I think. You will notice I've got odd shoes on. I'm trying to decide which ones to wear. I feel like the black is just so much more classic, isn't it? It just looks better, but the green is so much more comfortable and it's kind of like a bit of a pop of colour as well but I think I'm going to go for the black and I'm actually going to put some sandals in my bag and literally just when I get out of the taxi just pop these shoes on so I'm nice and comfortable. The weather is just oh, so sad today. It's annoying because this week it's been mostly quite sunny and warm but today is a little bit chilly and a little bit miserable so I feel like this dress doesn't really warrant a jacket and it would look so much better without one but I think I'm gonna have to just pop like my black blazer or something over the top because otherwise I'm gonna absolutely freeze and I'm gonna look really silly as well. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna decide on my shoes. I think I'm gonna go for these black ones. Don't really need to worry about comfort too much um, if I'm gonna take the sandals because I will be sat down. So hopefully they will be okay. Um, I've got a little while before my train actually. I've got about half an hour, which is good because Normally I'm rushing around, so I'm going to slowly get everything ready, get my clutch bag packed, um, and I'll be off. I believe the last thing that you will have seen was me at the Champion of Women Awards, which was so fun. I thoroughly enjoyed myself. Um, a really, really good way to spend a Friday. It's now the following week and I've had a nice delivery, so I thought I would unbox it with you guys. I actually filmed me unboxing it all and putting everything together this morning but I thought I would introduce it now that I've got some makeup on and I'm looking a little bit more presentable. So I had a lovely delivery from Decenio which if you don't know are like a print and frame um, company and they very kindly sent me some prints and some frames for my house. I already have a couple of theirs so I'm going to swap out some in the hallway and refresh them um, and I've got a few for my bedroom as well which is exciting so I'll show you them once they're all in the correct position. But yeah, I will put the footage of me unboxing and hanging everything up now. These items are part of a Instagram collaboration that I'm doing with Desenio, but um, it's not sponsored over here at all on YouTube. I just wanted to show you guys because I think there are some really nice prints in there. I did have a discount code, but unfortunately it's not valid anymore. It's only valid for 48 hours, which I know is really annoying. Um, but if I can find another one, then um, I will pop in the description for you. Okay, so here are all the prints in 
their frames and I'm going to place them where they are supposed to be placed and then I will show you. So this little Monet copy I've put on my chest of drawers. My grandma actually had um, one like this in her living room which we've got um, packed away somewhere and I thought this little one would be really cute to have in my room to kind of like remind me of her so I've just popped that on my dressing table and then I have these two bigger kind of illustrations on my other dressing table this one I really like it's called the abstract art collection the lines number two I think that's very cool and then this one as well is cute just in the black frames love it so this is the finished wall the new prints are up I absolutely love them I think it just makes the area a little bit brighter and they go really nicely with the colour on the wall as well. These are the ones that were on there before, also from Desenio. Um, I really like them, I love the grey, but it's just nice to have a little bit of a change, isn't it? Mix it up a little bit. So that is what we've done. This one is definitely my favourite. I love this one. And these little ones go so nicely with it as well. Very happy with this cute little space. This mirror, by the way, is from William Wood. And I'm obsessed with it. It's just got this little black outline and then the little black squares in it. Very, very cute. And again, it just makes this space a little bit lighter and a little bit brighter. Hi everyone. So it's Tuesday the 31st of May today and I am just getting ready to head to London. I'm off to meet Isabella and we're going for a nice early dinner at Bill's. And then we're going to a Lipsy event, which is actually at um, Isabel in Mayfair, which I'm so excited for because it's such a gorgeous location. So I've put a little bit of extra makeup on my face today to hopefully last into the evening. Um, I'm wearing this gorgeous Lipsy top. Excuse the state of my room, by the way. It's just what it's like when I'm trying to get ready and I'm late leaving the house. But I have this gorgeous, like, white Lipsy top on and i'm trying to decide what jackets wear with it so it looks really sunny now but there's a huge kind of dark cloud um, and the forecast says rain so i'm definitely going to need a jacket um so obviously i've got my black blazer on here these are just my old zara camel wide leg trousers and then a pair of stiletto boots so this is the black blazer or i might go for my leather jacket i feel like the leather jacket looks a bit better or this is the leather jacket it's quite difficult to dress for an evening event and like a semi kind of casual dinner. So I don't know if this is the correct kind of vibe. I don't know, I wish you could help me, but this moment will be long gone by the time you watch this vlog. Hi everyone, so I am, um, turn the aircon off. I am at the train station car park now um, and it's so warm and sunny and I feel a little too kind of wintry, like with my boots on and with a jacket. Um, I went for the leather jacket, by the way. I just thought it worked a bit better. I've heard on the radio that, um, I was just listening to Capital Radio, and I heard that it's like thunderstorms and like on and off raining there. But it's so sunny here. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I'm going to get really hot. But I know probably as soon as I get into town, it's just going to start tipping down so hopefully i'm just appropriately i forgot an umbrella but i just thought why am i taking an umbrella when the sun is out it seems a bit silly but anyway i was rushing about like i don't know what and i've still got 10 minutes before my train so i'm just gonna sit in the car and touch my makeup up before um i go to the platform everyone it is wednesday the first of june first day of june how exciting and i am off to london for the afternoon i'm going with my mum we're going for a spot of shopping just to have a little look around maybe get something to eat um so i thought i would show you my outfit so this is what i'm wearing my arquette blazer got my little jacquemus bag today because I always like to use this when the weather is nice and I haven't used it in ages. So I can't really take much with me today because as you can see, 
It's a very small bag. Uh, I've got my Celine Sunnies on my head. This little vest top is from Naked. And then these trousers are Zara. These are old though, so I will try and find a similar pair for you. And then I've just got on my Vegger trainers because they're nice and comfy. But I thought this was quite a nice, like, summery look. Um, it did say that it might rain today which is why I've gone for the blazer as well. But it looks really nice and sunny at the moment. So I will film what we get up to and where we go. Um, and I'll let you know if I buy anything. everybody just pause jack harlow there um i am now back from london we had a really lovely time went to all the places that i wanted to go to um didn't really pick up anything exciting i think i don't think i did film it actually but i tried on a bag in celine that i loved um and my mum told me to get it but i resisted um i'll insert a picture of me trying it on somewhere um i think i liked it a lot more because it really went with my outfit and i feel like that just really sold it to me i resisted uh i feel like i don't need to spend any more money um i need to save a little bit for a little while but we did pick up a few cute things in h&m home so i thought i would just quickly show you them before I end this vlog, so we can't really find a good place to set the camera down, so this is gonna have to do. Um, but we actually popped into Selfridges as well, as you would have seen, went to Grassery of Light for a little drink. And my mum got the cutest bouquet of flowers. How sweet is that? It was only nine pounds. I just thought, how pretty. So, I mean, I said only nine pounds, but that's quite expensive for the size of it, but very cute and then in h&m home we just got a few little bits nothing too exciting my mum got some flannels because she has the matching towels to these and then we got two of these little baskets they had them um styled with some like little flannels and products in so i thought they would be quite cute for the bathroom uh, but you could definitely use these anywhere and they were 7.99 each it's um jubilee weekend well the bank holiday starts tomorrow and the um pub in our village has got all the flags up and decorations it looks really cute anyway more from h&m home got two little things that are wrapped up cute little h&m home tape i've never actually been in that store before i don't think so it was quite nice to have a little look around. <laughs> Just gonna kneel down. Um, the weather stayed really nice as well. Got this cute little candle. Sun-dried linen. Smells so nice. I also picked up, how cute. Not quite sure what I'll do with this yet, but I thought it was really cute to put something on or maybe have it leaning up in the kitchen. So that is everything that I picked up. Nothing too exciting, but it was just nice to have a little browse. I'm really not sure what this vlog is going to turn out like. I feel like I've literally just filmed the odd day here and there that I thought might be somewhat interesting. So if it's a bit of a shambles, I'm sorry. I hope it was enjoyable for you guys to watch, but I am going to end it here and enjoy a nice relaxing bank holiday. Um, I'm going to try not to do any work although I do actually think I have some filming to do tomorrow I might try and leave that until next week but yeah I hope you all enjoyed your bank holiday this vlog will be going up way after so I hope you all had a lovely break if you did enjoy this complete mess of a vlog then it would be amazing if you could give it a like if you are new to my channel I would love it if you subscribed and I will see you all very soon with another video bye